my little rose petals and my little rose thorns welcome back to the channel for a sims 4 create a sim so i know in past videos and recently i've said that i've kind of been done with the sims 4 and that i really wasn't gonna play it anymore unless i really got a hankering to but i feel like right at this moment that is all water under the bridge because this is my first ever collab video with the lovely lady simmer who is known for her create a sims at least she's known to me and she is excellent at it so um i responded to her little twitter ad that she put out that she wanted to do a collab and we decided to do rival coven leaders so it's something that hasn't been done before which is great um because it's different and so i really took to this because supernatural was probably one of my favorite packs in the sims 3 and getting vampires in the sims 4 was pretty awesome because it came with a lot of new things and new interactions and new stuff because who doesn't love new stuff so yeah i was really excited to do this i tried to stick <clears throat> for this character with a more i kind of mixed modern and old you know old victorian era because you know vampires they've been around for ages they're immortal so they've probably been around for centuries and some of them have changed with the times and some of them haven't and i feel like for this vampress she kind of still sticks with the old age victorian era and still also has that modern flair about her so this is mirage beauclair she is the leader of the mothraki coven and so as a leader she takes care of the coven she makes sure that everyone is you know not being seen by the mortals and you know isn't going out into the sunlight she makes sure that feeding is discreet yet plentiful so um but as you can see mirage is very young she was kind of inherited the f uh, coven from her father so she's got some shoes to fill as far as her father and her father was not exactly a nice a nice man he was one of those vampires that was very feared but also very revered so she's got some shoes to fill and f at the moment she's filling them quite well with being a bit um on the evil side herself but she is also trying to find new ways to bring this old coven into the modern age so i tried to portray that and put a little spin on her outfits i'm pretty sure i did about five outfits for each category the everyday the formal the athletic the sleepwear and so on i'm pretty sure i did as many outfits as i could because i wanted to really bring across that she is centuries old but that she's you know in like our time frame so yeah i hope you guys like her um, I will be linking Lady Summer's channel and her video down below. I'll also be linking the house that I used in the little machinima at the beginning of the video because I did not build that. I downloaded it off of the um, Sims 4 gallery, so I will link that or at least link the creator down below. Um, I hope you guys like the machinima. It took me a little bit to make, but I thought it would kind of set the stage for this creator sim because... It is my first collab and I wanted to put my all into it. So yeah, I probably will put Mirage up on the gallery for you guys to download. And I think that's it. I don't think I'm going to spend the rest of my time chattering away. You guys are free to enjoy the video. Give it a like and give a subscribe if you want to see more videos from me. And look out for any collabs in the future. Bye guys.